All right, we've been walking around the woods for quite some time. But look at this. It's a big, big pit. Oh, Jesus Christ. I see a sinkhole. Oh yeah, this is it. Oh, you can tell because there's rope out here. Oh, someone left their persic. That's a good find. If this is yours, let me know, I'll mail it to you. All right. Whoo! Trusty old eight. bit deeper than I remember. <laughs> All right. Walking down to the edge of this pit. And I'm going to throw this rope down in here. Y'all ready? Yeah, dude. We're, we're set. Okay. This is pretty scary. I'm not going to lie. The rope keeps on like getting tighter and tighter. <laughs> Holy! All right, guys. I think it's time to go down this uh, giant hole in the earth. Really getting to see how deep this thing is because I've heard a couple different depths here. We're thinking it's about 180 feet. Holy crap, guys. A little bit. Oh, no. I think that's just gonna have to be how it is. Hey, yeah. This could probably use a rope pad. Well, actually, no, if I put it over here, we're good. When you come down, though, maybe bring one with you. Cool. I haven't been on rope in about a month. This is terrifying. I can't even see the bottom. Looks like a little ledge right here. And come over this ledge. Oh, is that the bottom I see? Oh, 
Oh my God, look at all this flowstone. Holy crap, guys. A bat over there. And look at that flowstone. Oh man, this is a cool little pit. <laughs> a little. This is a big pit. Oh, bro! All right. Let's check out what this thing has to offer. Oh, dude, this is beautiful. Check this little guy out. He likes bouncing pits too. <laughs> So this is the bottom of this pit. I think it is about 180 feet. Oh man, that, so all this rock and sticks, like you can tell a stick's been down here for a while, it's covered in calcite. Like that's all rock forming around it. That is insane. Turtle shell covered in calcite. Oh, this place is so cool. Whole actite forming. Whoa. Guess those are roots. Yeah. Down here, a little pool. Dead end. Yeah, cool little like formation bubble room. There's some bats in this rimstone, or <laughs> some bones in this rimstone dam. It's like the coolest grave ever. And if I just keep on going over here, completely dead ends. I was told there's not a whole lot down here, but Wow. All right. All right. There is another side to this. Whoa. You hear that? It's like a cave wind chime. That rope's moving. Someone else is coming down. Gonna sneak on over to the side. It's very sandy over here. That goes down. Huh. I wonder what's, if this, going under this rock is even accessible. I mean, it's completely dry over here. The water obviously doesn't drain in this part. But, yeah. Looks like it pinches off right back there, but, or maybe. Pinches off too, yeah. Super small little pit. That is a uh, um, amazing rappel though. I will say that. That was a very cool experience. Nice little introduction to get back on rope. We've taken pretty much the whole month of January off. I hear someone. I guess we're about to find out and get it on video too. This could get a little crazy if you know what I mean. Rope swing. Honestly. 
to stand back a little bit. Honestly, this could go bad in a heartbeat if I just let loose. If I didn't have a crack back, I wouldn't care. <laughs> Oh yeah, that sounded good. This sounds horrible. Mad sketchy. Mad sketchy. Like this is gonna let loose any second. I'm gonna go screaming that way. This is a little sketchier than I first envisioned. Can you climb up and then release it from that thing and then just? Oh, there we go. Nice. Oh yeah, you're golden now. <laughs> That's awesome. It's like a fun little rope swing right there. Heck yeah. Okay, so I kinda wanna push that overpass now. I mean I'm already on the rope, I might as well. Right. Alright. Coming up out of this pit. Here's a spot I can stand right here. Oh. Kinda. Kinda not. This is also pit rope, so. I hate looking down.
Hey guys. Is it unpromising? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, I hate being that like that, but it looks, no, it, it looks promising. It just looks like there's gonna be a lot of work involved to make it promising. Yeah. Yeah. It doesn't just open right up on the other side. Oh, if it did, we would have already been back there. <laughs> <laughs> we would already been back there. You warming up a little bit? Yeah. Cool. It's not an armadillo off across the... Oh, was it really an armadillo? Yeah. Hell yeah. Dude, I still don't think that's 175. No? No, I think that's like 125, 130. Damn. Oh, take this freaking harness off. Did you watch this video and think to yourself, I want to go caving too? Well, you need gear for it. And our buddy Ryan over at How Not To, the channel, compiled a awesome resource and a website that has all the caving and climbing gear you're ever going to need. I put the link in the description below. Go click on it. Go get some caving stuff. Go refresh your gear if you need to. And then at checkout, if you use the code JACOBMD, you're going to get 10% off. And those proceeds are going to come back to this channel and help me too so if you like this channel and you want to support the community go do ryan myself and yourself a favor by getting some gear over at how not to dot store link in the description make sure you go follow james and edward over at action adventure twins and my wife kelsey over at rock rat i'm gonna put their links in the description as well and as always i will see you guys next week